Pipe Drive versus HubSpot CRM. Which is the better CRM software in 2023? Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we will be taking a quick dive into Pipe Drive versus HubSpot. Both are amazing and established CRM softwares, and we're gonna do a side by side comparison of both. I have previously made beginner's guides on both of these, so if you don't know how to get started, check those out. But we're gonna be comparing which one might be the better software for you and your specific needs. So let's get into it. Now, starting off with their actual dashboards, what it's like to use them, the user experience, and then we're going to move on to the pricing and specific feature list. Starting off with Pipedrive. Now, in Pipedrive, you can see a navigation panel on your left. Then you have your section to manage your leads, deals, your projects, and campaigns. Then you have mail, activities, contacts, insights, products, and marketplace. In their marketplace, you can go onto Google Meet. You can link a bunch of different applications, but their applications are not as integrated as HubSpot sometimes does have automation features. Plus, with HubSpot, you can link your specific marketplace application. They have a larger asset for that and on the top you'll find the same kind of navigation bar as pipe drive now in terms of just basic features they're pretty much the same on both of these but the user ui of pipe drive is a lot cleaner and easier to use plus their leads their chat box their web forms are a lot more customizable and easy to navigate or manage as a beginner as well Plus, they have detailed analytics and insights depending on your project deal or specific amount, plus their visual sample data. So visual sample data, this is the sample data I'm using, but they will provide visual representation of your lead of your entire CRM. However, if we go on to HubSpot and you go into their report section, although I'm not saying that they have, you know, bad reports, their report section is pretty amazing as well. They do provide detailed reports. They don't have any form of visual tools to, you know, show your progress to maybe a manager or a ceo which can be a lot more helpful in terms of creating you know new representations because you can create visual data but it's all very um you know from scratch so you can click on chart overview then you can do next over here you're gonna have to set it up all yourself however with pipe drive you have you know a automated starter kit you could say where it's going to show some visual data of your deals and all of your progression as well now moving on to they manage leads and notifications pretty well on pipe drive however on hubspot their notification center just looks a little outdated overall the user ui is not going to be as friendly as it is on pipe drive because hubspot has been in the game for a while and i feel like they haven't upgraded or changed at all another thing with this is that their ticketing is a lot more complex to access but on pipe drive ticketing is a lot simpler you can click on your project and click on anything you need to manage from over here plus you can also just click on your contacts or just your campaigns to see what kind of campaigns you're running what kind of deals are incoming you know any any of the stuff that is related to ticketing can easily be found however on hubspot it is a little more difficult you have to go into your sales and go into your deals within the sales and deals you're not going to find your ticketing then you go into service then you go into ticketing or if it's regarding a specific sale a service is regarding to a specific sale you might want to resolve it over there other than having to move the ticket into the ticketing section and then be resolved later on However, both of these platforms handle automations pretty well. Uh, HubSpot has a larger access to apps, but Pipedrive have, say, better UI. So it just is, you know, both of their pros and cons are pretty much the same. Now, if we move on to pricing, because that can be a determining factor for a lot of businesses, and, you know, you might not care what it looks like. Plus, you might have a larger team you want to add, and they might have limitations on the number of members you can add. So, if we take a look at Pipedrive, their essential version starts at $9.90. And you can get a 14-day free trial of any of their um, plans. Now, in their essential versions, what do you get? Well... If we take a look at all of the features in their essentials version, you have your basic lead and deal management, you have customizable pipelines, you can create as much of those as you want, and you have a field limit of 30, however, and you have all of these other features. However, things such as email syncs, customizable email templates, merging fields, email tracking and scheduling, document signing is not included. 
but in terms of insights and reports they allow you to create 15 reports per user on their essentials version as well and you also have a sso as well as truth factor authentication and visibility group so you can create a specific visibility group such as a group for managers and that visibility group can uh, you know see a bunch of different user permissions or a bunch of different clusters of deals that you might not want your entire company to know now then you have the advanced version starting at 10,000 deals you know user and you can create 10,000 in deals they start at $19.19 you have things such as email sync and compatibility with email template customization as well as integrated workflow builder now if i was to compare their two base plans to hubspot now, this is a category in which HubSpot wins because HubSpot has free tools. Now, HubSpot does have their CRM suite and they do have certain specific products or bundles you can choose from, but they do provide certain you know the base level user tools for free so they have free cms tools free service tools free sales tools so you can do your sales and ticketing for free as well on hubspot which is not a option on pipedrive so if you're looking for a free crm then hubspot is definitely going to be your choice but if you take a look at their crm suite so their crm suite starts at 27 dollars per month which is actually a lot more expensive than Pipedrive where their uh, starter versions, both of their starter versions are less than $20. However, the starter versions where they have essential marketing services and sales features and operational software, all of that starts at $27 per month. And if you choose to pay upfront, that's the price you're gonna get. But if you choose to pay monthly, you're gonna get it for $30 per month, but you have, you know, all the operations hubs and you have features such as email highlights so automated emails you also have sales hub features like 500 minutes of calling auto uh, email replying you also have service hub features where you can create two ticket pipelines per account you have user management team emails you have features such as 10 dashboards and upwards of 10 reports per dashboard as well as uh, AHC payments as well and then if we take a look at their professional version now all of these versions uh the professional and enterprise versions are exclusive to people that really need them so you have to you know directly contact hubspot but it starts at 1600 dollars per month and they also have upwards of 2000 marketing contacts that you can add then their enterprise version starts at five thousand dollars per month where you have 10 paid users you have you know a bunch of different enterprise level features which i don't think are the focus for our video i think we're focusing more on mid-sized businesses and for any mid-sized business i would say pipe drive is the better option they're going to provide you with more value for money on their advanced version plus if you pay a little more than you would on the hubspot starter version you can get a lot more with the value of money with creating e-sign with creating legally binding contracts all of that is going to be a lot more helpful with pipe drive so i think if you want a free crm hubspot is for you and if you want a professional crm hubspot if you're, is for you but if you're a mid-sized business looking for some integrated features that can simplify your ticketing and your crm features then pipe drive is definitely the platform for you so I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and I will catch you guys in the next video.